No! Ugh. Why was my alarm clock set for so early? Ugh. <sighs> Morning, Mom. Um, why are you in your pajamas? Um, why wouldn't I be in my pajamas? Sweetie, you're going to summer camp today. Oh. My. Dog. I totally forgot. Gotta run! I gotta get these pajamas off. Okay. I'm gonna need Mr. Fluffy. Probably gonna need him. Look at my collar. No. What am I gonna put this in? Oh crap. I left my suitcase in my friend's house. Ugh. Wait. I know just the thing. So I gotta eat breakfast really, really, really fast. Well, it's nothing stopping you. It's all on the table. I gotta go right this second. Ah, now I have to go. Okay, Mom, Dad, I really, really gotta go, so can you just give me a kiss goodbye and then we can go? Um, okay. Goodbye. I'm gonna miss you, sweetie. I want this such a long time. Mom, seriously, I go to summer camp every single year. Okay, okay. Well, I hope you pass because the bus is gonna be here in five minutes. All right, I'm gonna go wait. I'm gonna miss her. Well, she'll be back soon. A month isn't that long if you think about it. <sighs> now, the board stuff. We're waiting. <gasps> ah, yes. A Hess truck. Hello, are you here to go to summer camp? Yeah, may I ask why this is a Hess truck? Oh, <laughs> we uh, always have troubles usually around this time of year with the buses and it broke down again so we usually have this baby for backup. We bought it at a auction. Okay, thank you for letting me know that. Well, this is the last neighborhood, and then we're gonna go to summer camp. So if I were you, I'd better hurry, because the children in the bus have been waiting for a long time. Mm-hmm, okay. And, uh, yeah. Oh, and I can take your bags. We usually take the bags and put them out front. Thanks.
from Earth. We actually were born here. Well, we were born here in Cybertron. Okay, is there like any way you can tell me exactly on the map where this is? Because I think this is a big phony joke. Ugh, why does my head hurt so bad? We believe that you got in a car crash down back on Earth. And this is actually like a different universe. Some people get transported through portals. What do you mean? Since you're back to normal, you're allowed to go, you know, out of the hospital care now. I, uh, you know, hope everything's okay with you. <sighs> Is there anything here besides concrete and grass? Ugh. Much for coming. No problem, miss. Um, may I ask again what it was that you wanted? You said you're on the case with that summer camp car wreck, aren't you? Yes, yes I am, ma'am. You didn't have to find Sylvia Pearl, did you? Um, no. There was only ten kids and one bus driver. Was there supposed to be eleven? <laughs> yes. She just got on the bus. <laughs> Oh, I am so sorry, miss. Um, but we will send out a search team to look for her right away. Thank you so much. Thank you. Just please excuse me for a second. Ugh. Ow! Ugh. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. No, I'm the one who should be sorry. Ugh, my head hurts so bad. Anyways, I, um, well, you seem a little confused. Last I remember, I got in a bus to summer camp and I just ended up here. My head hurts really bad and I remember blacking out in some weird field. Ugh, you must have traveled through a portal by accident when you fell. Hmm, hair. I, I was going to get some supplies to take back to town. If you want to come back to town with me, you can feel free to. There's a town here? Technically just a big house, but yeah. Oh yes, that'd be wonderful. Well, come on in. Wow, this place is awesome. Well, uh, why don't we take a look upstairs? Where are you gonna be staying? Okay, wait for me. This is the boys' room. We've been trying to find more ways to keep them out of looking in the girls' room, but it's kind of hard. We've offered them a lot of beds, and they just say that they're gonna be loudly and sleep on the floor, so they're kind of annoying. Now, the girls' room, on the other hand, is way more organized. We actually have three beds, and working on getting more. Well, the boys are trying to hit on every single one of us. I do have a boyfriend, though. His name is Alex. He's really cute, gray claw with blue eyes. Morning, Savannah. Oh, hey, Savannah. Hi, Savannah. <laughs> hey, guys. So, um, anything in the oven? Yeah, we're making cookies. Not to be rude, but may I ask who you brought with you this time? Oh. Um, well, this is Sylvia Pearl. Oh, um, well, nice to meet you, Sylvia. Nice to meet you, too. Um, Rebecca? Yeah? I think you may recognize her. Yes, you're the one I treated at the hospital. I'm pretty sure you might remember me, but of course you had short-term memory loss, so I'm not sure. Yes, I do remember you. Sorry I acted kind of mean when I first met you. I was just really confused. But I have a big question to ask. 
does anyone here have an idea on how to get out of this place? Hello? Sylvia, no one really wants to tell you. Um, why? Because you have to go somewhere forbidden. What do you mean? Here, I'll talk to you in the living room. Listen, Sylvia, to get out of here, it is super hard, and I don't think you'd ever be able to do it, no offense. What could be so terribly hard that I couldn't do it? You have to go to the Shadow Stone. Um, what's that? It's a place where you can make one wish, but legend has it, if you, if you go there, then you're never going to come back. Only the bravest of the brave went there once. He came back, barely alive though. We nursed him back to health, but he, uh, he said that he saw her. Saw who? She, he, he saw, I, uh, Sarasso. Who is that? It's the great evil. I can't pronounce it right, but she, she, she sends armies of the dead to to come after whoever passes. And he said that she, he saw her, and he barely made it. I can't just stay here. For all I know, my family probably already called the cops, and if they can't find me, they're gonna freak out. They're gonna, they're gonna totally like just panic, and they're gonna be so stressed out. I can't stay here. You don't understand. If you wanna go? You have to talk to the person that survived. Mind telling me who that is? Here, he's in the boys' room. His name's Arlington. Just, just ask someone if you can talk to Arlington. They'll take you right to him. Okay. Um, boys room? Good. But, um, to have the best results, just probably talk to Alex and say, you know, can I please talk to Arlington? And he'll be like, oh yeah, sure, he's right over here. So yeah. Okay. Um, are you Alex? Yep. Um, is there something you need? Is there any way I could talk to Arlington? Yeah, sure. He's right over here. Ah, she was right. Here you go. Thanks. You're welcome. Hi, um, may I ask if you're Arlington? Uh, I'm glad you asked. My name is actually Marlton. If you ask Alex, he always gets us mixed up. If you want to talk to Arlington, you should have just asked me. Well then, um, can you, um, you know, tell me where Arlington is so I can talk to him? You know, it's not often that we get girls in the boys' room. May I ask why you're here? But don't worry, I'm still gonna take it to him. I'm just really curious. Oh, um, I was gonna talk to him about the, um, the shadow dome thing. Okay. Here's Arlington. Hi. Oh, hi. Are you Arlington? Yep. Um, wow. You know, you're very pretty. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I kind of get that a lot. Yeah, I'm kind of sure that you do. Anyways, so if you're here about the whole entire Shadows Dome thing, I'd be glad to talk to you about it. Because pretty much everyone is that wants to talk to me. Well, yeah, that's kind of the thing. Okay. Whoa. I have a feeling that you're gonna talk to me because you wanna go, right? Yeah, I have to get back home. I mean, you know. And my friend Savannah told me this was the best advice. You know, to take advice from you because it's the best, you know, way to go. But yeah, Savannah, she's really nice. Okay, do you mind if I, you know, go downstairs? No, no, of course not. Okay, so the advice is, 
stay alive. Sorry to ask, but are you just a fraud? Because I think I already know that. Well, um, I'm not a fraud. But I'm going to say that when you hear the, the screaming souls, you, you just act like you're invisible. And you have to go to the main middle of the whole entire Shadow's Dome to get to the place to make the wish, if you survive that long. If you make the correct, the correct wish and wish that you are back home and that, well, don't wish like, you know, I wish I was back home and, you know, before any of this happened, just wish that you were back home at the current time that's standing, okay? Okay, and if it works, then you will be back home. But some people get caught up in the wishing thing and it tears apart the body parts from them you know, limb by limb. <laughs> I'm joking. If the wishing gets caught up, then you'll just get teleported back to the girls' room. And if you're boy, the boys' room. You only have one wish, though. So if you blow it, then um, you're kind of doomed forever. May I ask why you didn't go back home? Oh, I came in this portal on purpose. I don't want to go back home. I don't really have a family waiting for me. They kind of hate me. Oh. Okay, well, thank you so much for the advice, but I better get to bed. It's really getting late. Okay, I'm gonna turn the light off. It kind of turned the lights off in the whole entire house. Um, I was kind of, you know, wondering if maybe you wanna go on a date sometime? Oh, I, I'd love to. Thank you for asking. Well, um, I probably should get get to bed. Oh, yeah, um, it's probably a good idea. Um, tomorrow, seven. Um, don't be late. Sorry. 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 Wow, this place is so much more. Less messy.